Before we get started with today's video, I have a huge announcement and that is the introduction of my third channel called the Universe of AI. Now guys, don't worry, I'm not switching over to a new channel, I'm still going to be posting on World of AI, but Universe of AI is where I'm going to be doing live streams, live demos, showing my face, and posting more about what's happening in the AI space on a faster basis, I would say. Because we have so many different models being released, and I can't really get to all of that on the main channel, which is why my team and I are launching this third channel so that we can focus on almost everything that's happening in the world of ai so definitely recommend that you subscribe i would really appreciate it if you can not saying you have to but if you're interested in this definitely subscribe turn on the notification bell and you should see an upload this week so thank you guys so much for all the support and i hopefully wish that this new channel can help you guys as much as this main channel can Yesterday, we had taken a deeper dive into the Gemini 2.5 Pro model, which is exceptional with code generation. It is a state-of-the-art thinking model that is quite impressive as it leads in almost every benchmark against models like GPT 4.5, DeepSeek R1, as well as Claude 3.7 Sonnet. It's enhanced with reasoning and coding, and it has a 1 million context window. It's super cost efficient and you can actually get a free API via Open Router. Just take a look at it in action. The Gemini 2.5 Pro model is powering Klein with the Blender MCP server to autonomously create a Klein logo, which is insane. Now, if you were to see my video yesterday on the Gemini 2.5 Instant Coder, this model can fully efficiently create a full on application for you in one shot. This is due to its context window, and I think that's the beauty of this model. It's capable of creating anything with one single prompt, and that's why I really wanted to showcase this model with something like Klein, which I believe is a better coder than Instant Coder. For the people who do not know, Klein is an autonomous coding agent that you can directly access within your IDE, whether that's VS Code, Cursor, or many of the other ones that are out there. And it's capable of creating, editing files, executing commands, using the browser, and so much more autonomously or with your permission each step of the way. To get started, it's super simple. You need to make sure that you have an IDE. I'm gonna be using Visual Studio Code because I believe it works best with it. Make sure you have the client extension installed. You can easily do so by going over to the repo, clicking on this link, and it will take you to this marketplace, which you can then click on install, and then it will prompt open VS Code to then have it uh, install this extension within your IDE. So you can see, I can then go over to the extension within VS Code, and then I can click install and you're going to be then able to access it on the left hand panel in which you can click the settings tab and then place in your API key for the provider you want to use. If you want to use a free provider, click on open router, paste in your API key that you can get from over here, which I'll leave a link to in the description below. And what you can then do is select the free model. So search up Gemini 2.5. There we go. So just select this, click done, and then you're going to be able to start generating with the free model. Before we get started, I just want to mention that you should definitely go ahead and subscribe to the World of AI newsletter. I'm constantly posting different newsletters on a weekly basis, so this is where you can easily get up-to-date knowledge about what is happening in the AI space. So definitely go ahead and subscribe as this is completely for free. Now, personally, I'm going to be using the Google Gemini API key, which I'm going to be paying for, but it's super cheap. It's practically free. And what you will need to do is select the Google Gemini API provider and then select the 2.5 Pro experimental model. And then you can paste in the key by going over to Google AI Studio clicking on get API key and then generate your key, link it to a billing account and then paste it in over here and click done. So let's get started. Essentially what I'm gonna be showcasing is how proficient this model is with Klein, making it one of the best AI coders that's out there. We're gonna be showcasing a couple examples of what you're capable of doing and then having it powered with a couple of different MCP servers to enhance its capabilities even further. So let's get started. We're first gonna have it create a modern AI course website with a built-in code editor. Now, what I would recommend you do when you're working with Klein is use the plan mode first to fully generate a structured plan for this prompt so that it's easier for the model to generate within the act mode. And there we go. We now have this Gemini model generating this AI course website, which actually looks really cool. I've opened it up and this is 
the first iteration in one shot it was capable of generating this site for us you have the video tutorials you have the interactive ai coder uh, where you can work with python code and this was all generated in one shot which is just crazy to me now what i'm going to do is work on improving this even further maybe revamping the whole uh site itself and that's by prompting it a little bit further so let's see what i can do to make it even better and look at that we have a new redesign for this ai course website and we actually have a couple of new features which makes it a lot better you can explore the courses over here you have a footer and we can actually try out the code editor over here and this is actually something that it was capable of generating now obviously not everything is functional yet but it got the gist of generating this even further and this is the second iteration that it was capable of doing with a single prompt so in total i've only used two prompts to generate these two iterations which is crazy because with other models it would take multiple generations to get a base structure of an app generated now honestly the possibilities with this model is endless and i can just keep on going and showcasing more web apps being generated but let's take this a step further if you go over to Klein and click on mcp servers this is where you can additionally add different plugins and tools with these mcp servers to make it even better where you can add an integration with blender or many of these other plugins to enhance the capability even further for example, we can have Stagehand or Browser Use installed as an MCP server so that we can have browser automation configured with this model. So I'm quickly going ahead and installing this MCP server. Once that is done, we can then have the features of browser use within Klein so that the Gemini 2.5 model can automate browser-based tasks for us. So let me just showcase an example live in action where I can process and automate web-based tasks now with this MCP server linked with the gemini 2.5 model this is where i'm having it navigate to google.com and then having it find the search bar and type in the latest ai research breakthroughs click on google search button extract the text contents on the first page of the search results and then summarize the main findings from the extracted results so let's see what it's capable of doing you can see stagehand is performing this action right now and it is typing in the latest ai research breakthroughs and then afterwards it's gonna go ahead and provide me a summary of all the different breakthroughs that it was capable of finding and there we go it was capable of finding a summary of all the different breakthroughs from generative ai to ai in science and medicine and etc this was all done with the mcp server being powered by the gemini 2.5 pro model now this is just a simple example of what i can do you can even extract contents web scrape even data analysis with this model connected with mcp servers next up i'm gonna have it work on an in-depth prompt where i'm asking it to do multiple things such as conducting an in-depth stock analysis of tesla's stock and then i'm gonna have it focus on creating a dashboard that showcases all its findings like the eps the revenue margins and etc and i'm gonna have it all portrayed within this stock app so it looks like it has finished developing this tesla stock analysis dashboard and you have so many different analysis from price trends the technical indicators now obviously it doesn't look amazing but it did get the job done you can see that it has all the different price trends over here you have different graphs for this on uh, different time frames from yearly five years and it actually depicts accurate data if we go back we can take a look at the technical indicators which also showcases the macd the rsi and after going through each of these different uh, reports that is made on different categories you can see how well it did in terms of generating different contents now obviously not everything is perfect like the font isn't perfect in this case which is kind of a problem when you work with generating something this large but overall it did a great job in terms of generating most of the things that we had requested so definitely i uh, am like super surprised to see that the gemini 2.5 model was capable of doing this and i love the output that it had provided for this app so huge props to the model for generating this and i definitely recommend that you use it so that it could be used for data analysis or even just prototyping different apps for you if you like this video and would love to support the channel 
you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis, plus daily AI news and exclusive content, plus a lot more. In conclusion, I'm really grateful for this Gemini 2.5 model because it's essentially the best model that's out there, not just for coding. We've only touched the tip of the iceberg with this video because there's so many other different things that we haven't covered, like the agenda capabilities or function calling or its proficiency in different categories like math or science. This is a great all-rounded model, which is why I definitely recommend that you try it out. But essentially having it paired with something like Klein makes it even more powerful. So definitely recommend that you try this out. This combination is probably the best AI coder that's out there with its pricing as well as its performance. But with that thought guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spare positivity. Subscribe to the newsletter. Follow me on the Patreon. Follow me on Twitter. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe to the YouTube channel so that you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. But with that thought guys, have an amazing day. Spare positivity. And I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.